Hey, what's up, guys? This is Jeff, and I'm doing my day trading recap. Today's Friday, December 13th. Happy Friday. So I took Cien uh, for a five-minute opening range break up, uh, but I was actually watching this, you know, for a red to green move. It didn't do that. So the idea is on the daily, you can see here, look at this beautiful uh, bullish candle uh, gapped up based on earnings, almost closing all the way at the high. So this is a good um, candidate for uh, red to green move for continuation play the next day. Look at that volume, right? So huge volume closing near the highs. Um, so well, the idea is of a red to green move, it opens red and then it punches through previous day close. You want to get long, set your stop somewhere on the intraday chart. Look for a good definitive stop. Um, but today it actually just opened uh, green. So uh, let me show you what I saw here. So we waited for the first five minutes just to make sure, right? So I noticed that there, I had this level here of 42.77. Pre-market, it was holding that level here, as you can see, 42.77, right? So I want, actually wanted to see this open, test previous stay close. Um, it didn't actually do that, but what it did do is, you know, what I normally like to see when I get into swing trades is I want to see the stop clear the high of the day. So this high of the day was... 42.95 as you can see so you know when this stock opened it punched all you know all through those levels but i wanted to wait for the first five minutes so for a five minute opening range as you can see it came almost tested this uh previous day close but it did respect that 42.77 um area that i found in pre-market look at it, it's just holding this right right when it pulled back bounced off of it again creating basically a double bottom, right? I knew to take this long and also cleared 42.95. I showed you the uh, the high of uh, previous day close. So I got long, set my stop right there and yeah, rode this on the way up. So uh, on the way up, I took partials right here on that pop. Look at that big volume, very nice. Took I was just taking quarters off on the way up and uh, I feel like this could be a good candidate for, you know, this could be potentially trending for the rest of the day. And I really, really wanted to get to this 4407 level. But once the trend started breaking down here, um, made a new five minute low, I took some, I took more off. Um, once it broke this five minute low, I just got all out. So uh, yeah, um, it was a really, really good trade. Just one trade, one and done day for me. And uh, yeah. Uh, ended up being a good play. I, I feel like these these patterns that you find for continuation play for a possible red to green move or just basically a continuation play uh, can make uh, explosive moves and uh, you have some sort of thesis going into the trade um, and uh, basically you have a bias and at least you have something that you're working with and you're not just winging it. So um, a lot of the stocks that I was actually watching actually made these moves and um, let me show you. Um, Look at Chewy here, right? Three day continuation play. Look at this beautiful orb. I mean, you could have caught this beautiful orb. Gorgeous. So, uh, yeah, man, be on the lookout for those continuation plays, guys, because uh, they're, they're they they make really really great moves. And um, I actually played um, Adobe, but this one I didn't even want to bother day trading this. Uh, so I actually got got in this for a gap and go. So I got in right at the open um, for a swing trade. So I'm in here. Let me see what. See what my entry is. My entry is uh, three fourteen eighty two right now. So um, this one is actually working out really well. So this is this is another strategy that I like to play. Um, so this is a earnings gap up, and the reason why I really really like this one, I want you to notice this is all time highs, guys. All time highs. Beautiful cup, handle, breakaway gap on a positive catalyst, and it was an earnings beat. So. This is the 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 beginning of a of a, a new continued uptrend where the stock is at all time highs. So um, yeah, uh, these are the stocks that you want to watch. You want to watch these um, these plays. So um, yeah, if you guys have any questions, comments, feel free to leave it at the bottom. Other than that, I hope everyone has a beautiful weekend, and I will see you guys on Monday.